I found the world's cheapest uh, hotel on Airbnb. The lowest you can sell your place for is like $10 a night. I found this listing with hardly any photos and asked how many nights she would give me for $10. That sounds bad. Well, she said 10. That's a dollar per night. Not bad, huh? Even though this place is only a dollar a night, I want to treat this like it's a five-star hotel. That means I need to find a way to achieve all of these amenities while I'm here. So here we've got the beautiful bed. I mean, so cozy. A couple nightstands. What more could you ask for? They're calling these three dumbbells the fitness center. How about you sit back? I'm literally wearing boots. This isn't bad at all. Pillows, 10 out of 10. You know, I didn't expect this, I didn't expect the world's cheapest hotel to turn into a survival challenge, all right? I wouldn't be as terrified right now, but on the way over here, we literally saw a wolf and a dead horse carcass. What is out here killing horses that can't kill me? I'm 5'8". Maybe. This is literally a kiddie pool with gallons of water in it. Ah! I almost passed out there. I need to stop screaming like that. I don't do survival things. I'm literally on my own out here. The nearest hospital is only about six hours that way. So if something bad happens, I'm literally dead. <laughs> Why am I laughing at that? By the looks of it, I've got about Two hours of sunlight left. Oh. Let me show you what I packed to prepare. <laughs> First of all, I got on boots. New boot goofing. Oh no. Oh my gosh. Oh, oh, oh no. Oh no. Ah, got it. A sleeping bag. Flashlight. Swiss <laughs> Army knife, baby. In case any bears wanna throw hands. Oh, I thought he said a bear. What is. Is that a rock? Got some durable washcloths in case I have to take an absolute dumper. Got a half drink in Arizona iced tea. Hand warmers. Some jerky. Mini pretzels, bear attack deterrent, and maybe the most important, fire sticks. I actually want to start a fire before the sun goes down. I just have to find a tree. Oh no. There's literally not even one tree out here. I spent the next 30 minutes gathering rocks. Any rock I could find. The truth is, I am very scared. A fire is going to keep me warm and deter animals, and it's kind of do or die right now. I need to get this fire started. It's so cold out here. It's so cold. I need fire. Oh, I need fire. Let's see if this lights. I don't know if this stuff really catches on fire, to be honest. Oh, it's getting really cold. I'm okay. I am fine. The only bad news as of right now is the fire didn't start. And for some reason, my flashlight doesn't work. Are you serious? At least I've got my washcloths. So I actually found this cardboard box under the bed and it actually had some valuable stuff in it. Look at that. What else is in here? They left me a sleeping mask. What is this? No way. Room service? There's no way this is for real. I'm literally so far away from everything. Three, three, four. There's no way. I doubt anyone's gonna answer. Thank you for calling the front desk. Stella, how may I help you? Is this room service? Yeah, can I get a, a hamburger? Okay, that should be about 30 minutes, and we'll see you soon. Okay, who did I just call? The front desk of what? The front desk of pain, apparently. The sun has set, darkness has set in, and the cold is blistering. It wasn't until 10 p.m. that the driver called me saying he was lost, so Haley went to go meet up with him in the nearest town and dropped the food off for me. Well, the food's here. Five hours later. <laughs> Thank goodness. <laughs> this is insane. This is absolutely insane. It's literally McDonald's. <laughs> These fries are so cold. <laughs> According to the weather, the feel like tonight is gonna get down to negative two degrees. And at this point, I feel like I have no choice but to try to start this fire again. The good news, however, is I actually found another lighter in my luggage. <laughs> no. Oh yes. <laughs> Guys, we got this. I'm gonna set myself on fire over here. As cold as it is. I just farted. We got this. We didn't got this. I don't know if this stuff is flammable. Man, I'm so bummed out about this fire. But at the end of the day, I just gotta keep on keeping on. I literally can't wait for the sun to rise. If I were to rate this on like hotels.com, I would give it two out of five so far. What the heck was that? 
What the heck was that? Oh, it's midnight right now. The McDonald's is bomb. It was literally hard as a rock, but it was bomb. However, I do have something up my sleeve that I think is gonna be literally insane if it works. <laughs> I have a generator, my PS4, and a monitor. I brought a hotspot. If the internet connection is success, <laughs> no way it worked! <laughs> Fortnite. Why does this feel like a bigger success than actually lighting a fire? My face, my facial is just non-existent. All features. Watch, a bear's gonna pull up and wanna play duos. Just my luck. Ah, <laughs> oh, I look gross. This looks like fake. Guys, I'm in the desert. <laughs> There's literally snow on the ground. Look at this, look at it. I think now's a good time to tell you. This year, I'm trying to give away a million dollars to my subscribers. The way I'm doing it is every time someone subscribes to me, I add 10 cents to this piggy bank. This month, I'm giving away $1,000 to as many of you as possible. So if you gain 200,000 subs, that means $20,000 that I'm giving away to you guys. Ninja is quaking. My fingers feel like frozen fish sticks. I I just died. Is that what my life has come to? My extremities just feeling like frozen delicacies? Did this guy die? I just lost to a bot. I need to go to bed. This is the first time I've seen my face in a while, and I literally think I'm turning green. Is my face... Gamer boys, this very well might be the coldest hotel room I've ever been in. <laughs> I'm gonna try to just get some sleep tonight. It's quite literally snowing. I got that thing on me, that bear repellent. With that being said... <sighs> Good night. <sighs> Good morning. The wind was the hardest part, but my sleeping bag was awesome. I physically can't feel my lips. Check out is in like 30 minutes, so I'm just soaking it up, you know. Rocking the eight pound dumbbell thing, I'm gonna get a little workout in. Um, if you guys think I'm cold right now, don't worry. It's only four degrees. I've got my fuzzy Crocs on, we're chilling. No pun intended. I don't even know what to do with this dumbbell right now. There's like only so many movements. Look at that big, juicy, fat. Sunrise. Even though this challenge is coming to an end, I said, you know what? I'm gonna run 10 miles. Just kidding. I'm gonna sit down on this bed, drink some Arizona iced tea. Oh, it's it's literally frozen solid. That's crazy. Frozen solid. <laughs> Even the hand warmers are frozen solid. I've officially completed a night at the world's cheapest hotel. I honestly thought I was gonna die a few times last night. One of which being when I was playing Fortnite. Then I did die. Maybe I did. But this was not bad. Okay. Apart from the fact that this hotel is really just a full-size bed with a frozen mattress, a kiddie pool filled with frozen water jug, and somebody's grandma's dumbbells, all in the middle of nowhere, I kind of loved this. In fact, my ride is almost here, and I don't even care. I could literally stay here for... Hot cocoa check. So good. Smash like. <laughs>